A taste of spring, temperatures soaring mm -hmm. into the 50s. It felt good today, but there's a weather alert with rain, snow, and ice on the way, and we want you to be prepared. Chief Meteorologist Albert Ramon is here with the critical timing. Albert. We're going to see it all over the next 24 hours, and it's kicking off right now, and spring felt like it, didn't it? 53 the high today in Chicago. That's running 17 degrees above average, and we're still in the 50s in most spots right now. Doppler radar, for the most part, this is light rain, but the last couple of scans, I've noticed there's a few embedded areas of moderate rain being detected and that will be the trend as our next cold front approaches from the north enhances the rain for the rest of the evening and then spilling cold air behind that front as we roll through the overnight. So now through nine o'clock, watch the uptick in both coverage and intensity of the rain downpours mid to late evening. Even a few rumbles of thunder will be possible. And then after midnight, a lot of the rain begins to scoot off towards the east. But we start to see that cold air come in between 2 a.m. and 4 a.m. tomorrow morning will be a window of seeing freezing rain and sleet and light accumulation of ice will be possible. And look at this 7 a.m. dry air moves in and we're quiet on the Doppler radar for several hours, maybe between 6 a.m. and 10 a.m. where we don't have a whole lot going on ahead of another disturbance that will bring in the snow chances. So late morning and through the afternoon on Thursday, snow likely some of this tomorrow afternoon 2 to 5 p.m. could be on the heavy side along with strong northerly winds blowing snow for the afternoon and evening commute for tomorrow, reducing visibility. So there's a little bit of uh, quiet weather for the first half of tomorrow before the snow comes up in a big way, and then we're done with it by late tomorrow evening. Here's a look at the latest projections on how much snow we're going to see in that window of time late tomorrow morning into the early evening on Thursday. The heaviest amounts will be southern areas of Kankakee County to Rensselaer to just south of Valparaiso. Places down here could see or exceed eight inches of snowfall, and even across Cook County, there will be a large spread from one to four inches on the northern side of Cook County to maybe as much as five to eight inches extreme southern areas of Cook County downtown and points back off towards the west in that two to five inch range. And then as you get up here towards the north, Lake and McHenry County up to an inch will be possible, but there'll be some locations that may not even exceed an inch where we are expecting the heaviest snow to occur tomorrow. You're under a winter storm warning really from downtown to the south and back off towards the southeast, including all of northwest Indiana, northern sections of Cook County and back off towards the west. You're under a winter weather advisory. Snow accumulation for you, but not nearly as heavy as areas down to the south of you. 29 blowing snow for tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. Cold start on Friday with 9 in the morning, 27 in the afternoon, but we're done with the snow. And then 20s to 40s this upcoming weekend. And temperatures for much of next week look to be above average. So again, busy, Brad Erica, yeah. next 24 hours, but we'll be here with you. Keep you updated. Yes, we know you will. Thank you, Albert.